Hi guys! In this video, I will show you how to install a CDM from GLTN repository. Now in the previous video, I showed you how to install a CDM from a bundled executable that contained QGIS, PostgreSQL, PostGIS, and sample data. Today, my video will focus especially on those people who already have QGIS on their computers and would like to install SCDM as a single plugin. First, go to your menu in QGIS and click on Plugins. On the drop-down menu, click on Manage and Install Plugins. A window with various tabs will open showing you the following. Number one, a tab showing all plugins, installed and non-installed plugins. Second one will be for all installed plugins, that is, all the plugins that are already installed in QGIS. Next is the Not Installed Plugin tab. This one has a list of all the plugins that have not been installed in QGIS, but are available in the remote repository. The fourth tab is the Upgrade Plugin tab that shows you all the plugins that require updating. Finally, there is the Settings tab. This section allows you to add or remove repositories where you would pull all other plugins. In case you do not have the repository set up for any plugins that you would want to install, click on Add and enter the link to the plugin. In the event that you do not have the repository for SCDM on your computer, enter the following URL link. Since ours is already installed, I will go ahead to All tab and type in Social Tanya Domain Model on the search panel. Click on it. Details regarding SCDM will open on the right side of the window. If we had already installed it and wanted to upgrade it, we would click on Upgrade. But since we want to install it, go ahead and click on Install Plugin a pop-up with the installation process will immediately appear. Again, the speed of the installation depends on the speed of your internet connection. To verify again that it has been installed, click on the Installed tab and search for Social Tenure Domain Model. As you can see, it appears here as installed. Once you're done, you can then exit this window by clicking the Close button. Our plugin has been successfully installed, and all that now remains is for you to log in and start using STDM. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.